Finally, was kind of talking about how maybe the last few minutes of the game at Oklahoma was maybe a confidence builder for you guys. Do you see it as that way? Yeah, I mean, we really found ways to score when we needed to. We got a couple stops, obviously. Wish we could have gotten one more. But, yeah, we found ways to score against them, which hopefully will translate into this next game. What's the biggest thing you learned during that game that you can take into this one? Yeah, I think we just played fast and moved the ball, and people stepped up and hit big shots when we needed them to. How do you avoid playing at their pace? Yeah, I mean, they play very fast, so we're definitely going to have to get stops in transition because they really throw the ball ahead and run. So we'll need to get some stops in transition and then keep scoring on our end. You've had a lot of success kind of holding Taylor in check. She's approaching a big record. Is mm -hmm. that a goal of yours? Like, I'm going to do everything to stop her from reaching that? I mean, a goal of mine on defense is always to stop them from scoring in whatever way I can. So I think it'll be the same tomorrow as it will be in any other game. When you're playing in Hilton and it's packed, which it will be, um, and the game has pace to it and mm -hmm. teams are getting up and down, how much fun is that? It's a lot of fun. Hilton's a really special place. Um, so it's fun when we get a lot of fans like we always do. And we have a lot of people that support us, so it's a lot of fun to play there. What's your mindset going into place in the standings on Saturday with this group that you guys have been with and what you've got through this year? Yeah, this is a big game for us, but we always take it one game at a time. So we got to be ready to go Saturday and try to get the win at home.